All right, so this is another mod to my SEMA X8HC. And now uh, what I've modded is the landing gear. This is actually landing gear that I bought off eBay for $3 shipped from China. And this is landing gear for uh, DJ, DJI Phantom 1 or 2 Vision. And the cool thing about that is the landing gear will bolt directly up. So landing gear for the for for those two um, will bolt bolt directly to the SEMA. Um, this is like extra tall landing gear, um, and it's it works really good. The only thing that sucks about it is the bolts right here where they actually bolt in. I probably should put some washers in here just in case I land really hard. I don't want it to pull through the plastic, the bolts will pull through. But other than that, it seems to work pretty good. The only thing is that, you know, it almost makes it uh, like completely useless to have this this extension arm for the camera. I could bring the camera down farther because I have a lot of room here. But uh, I'm debating whether just to bring the camera back up because uh, I don't actually need that. I could actually drop the camera lower too and it'll kind of help to be able to uh, get stuff out of the way. But the problem now, or the issue is fixed with the landing gear being in the footage because it's so far out and so wide in the front. So that kind of fixes all of that. So I could actually take this arm off if I wanted to, but we're gonna leave it on for right now and we'll see what happens. Um, this is probably almost the last mod. Uh, the last mod is actually just a fix because, uh, as I've said before in every video, this quadcopter came. It's supposed to have auto hover. It doesn't work, which has been interesting because it's it's really cool that I have learned to fly it and and hover it as well as I can um, without any help. I did buy a clip for a phone. And that's just in case I wanted to use my FPV camera for this particular quadcopter, which is just another light dial camera. So that's pretty much the setup for that. The only other mod I have would be to put the new board on, which I've already purchased. As you can see in the center, that's, I don't know if you can see that, yeah. The center chip, that is the chip that I think is messed up on this one. That is the barometer chip that allows it to auto hover so that'll be kind of the last mod is putting the board on I don't know if uh, I mean if people want to see me actually take it apart and put the board on it might be a kind of convoluted video but this you can find that stuff so I might not even do a video on that um, maybe just some flight stuff after I've you know installed it but that's pretty much it that's all I'm doing to this quad pretty much I'm not going to do anything else flies really good it's definitely worth the money as far as an aerial footage you know quad on the cheap so definitely thumbs up to that but uh, yeah so that's the quad setup now and uh, the only other thing I might do is uh, they actually sell some uh, some different uh, landing gear that actually has another bar here for a little bit more support and uh, I was thinking about maybe picking up some of that landing gear, but I don't know. We'll see what happens. All right, you guys, take it easy. Peace out.